Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Now I've just made the big mistake of recording or recording this video but not uh, recording my voice so I'm gonna have to record it again for the second time but it won't take too much of my time up because today's video we're gonna be looking at the new update and podium uh, pass series 2 which is um, the update 1.09 which is the new update to the car liveries. I think the major one is McLaren with the uh, rainbow colours on the side pod. But anyway, today we're going to be looking at the podium pass, um, mostly at the uh, new tiers, what they have got, as you can see on the screen at the moment. So we'll go to the podium pass now for Series 2. And in the first one, we've got um, a decent uh, livery. It's not too, uh, not that special. And we've got a nice racing suit as we go a bit along here. We've got a legendary car on the second tier already. And it is a end racism car, which I must say I do rate this livery quite a lot is a very cool delivery to have on the game um help to bring aware awareness um to end racism as well as if we go a bit further along here we've got another livery in helmet design here we'll say most attractive livery this one here and then we get another legendary on tier 4 which is the we racers one livery with the uh, rainbow colors on the car which is another cool one and then it's on tier 5 where you get the first pit coins which is 2500 um I think all the pit coins you get at should add up to 9,000 because that's how much the VIP is. I just bought it, which is uh, 9,000 pit coins here. As you can see, I might go a bit, a bit along. Uh, we'll wait till the uh, a bit later. We'll just go through a few more tiers as we get the, uh, on tier six. Another legendary. It, this time it is going to be a race suit, which is the end racism on it, which is a another cool design to have, and then here on tier 7 is the first logo um, design sort of uh, object here I think I don't know what really you could use that for I think maybe if you made like a BMW uh, my team career mode you could maybe use that for the inner part make like white and black I believe it is on the uh, BMW I don't know it could be white and blue I'm not quite sure and that's another cool helmet design as we come on to tier 8 now we got the uh, rainbow over overalls as we race as one that's another cool one to have that's something to do on a maybe a career mode on my team i think it's more my team just a, like a, a one-off weekend where you put it on the car uh, for a special uh, livery and then here on tier 9 we've got sort of like a, a jaguar british racing green livery here here yeah. and then our first emote which is a, a tada which is uh nothing special there but you okay and then on tier 10 we get two legend legendaries here which is a End racism helmet, which I must say I really do like the end racism uh, sort of design on the car and helmet, as well as the overalls here. And then we've got another livery here, which could be if you uh, haven't tuned into our Lamborghini cream, I, I do advise you to do. It's very enjoyable, but this is perfect for it because it's got the Italian colours on the side, the green, white, and red, as well as it's got the Lamborghini colours of yellow and black, which is a uh, I think it's a cool livery idea to have. Uh, for the Italian Grand Prix when we do it so that could be a, a livery we could use uh, slash run for the Italian Grand Prix at Lamborghini's home race so that's a very cool logo to have uh, not logo but livery to have in the, uh, have in the game I was go a bit further along here nothing special on them too so we get a race as one helmet and then we get on tier 13 we get another pit coin um, 2500 once again so that's overall 5,000 in the first 13 feet tiers and then we get a pretty uh, weird um, race suit here, it's a bit random this one uh, I wouldn't say I necessarily like this, it's a bit random um, as we get the end of races and gloves go around and this is our first legendary um, emote here which is kind of that Sebastian, Bell, Se Se Sebastian Vettel uh, celebration the uh, Egyptian dance, that's a very cool uh, I must say that's probably the best one they have in the game so far at the moment as we now come a bit further on we got the races one gloves and then we've got a uh, panther uh, logo design here which we could uh, maybe use for the Jaguar I know it's not a Jaguar but it's uh, it's kind of similar to a Jaguar in it so um, I think later on this week I'm going to do a Jaguar livery idea for F1 2020 my team because um, I know you've all been enjoying the last few ones. I know I've done a Porsche, uh, Aston Martin, most recently the Alpine F1 team. So I think the next one is going to be Jaguar because I know someone did want me to do that. 
the Formula E version, but I think I'm going to stick with the just normal Jaguar version if they did come to Formula 1. Whereas we've got a bit along now, we've got a uh, cool uh, glove design here, Alphabeti it's called. Which is cool to see, we've got another emote there called Flexin, which uh, reminds me of a bit, a bit of Daniel Ricciardo. And there's we go a bit further on now, we get another set of pit coins here on tier 21, so it's about 7,500, 7, so yeah, I guess there's going to be uh, one more, which will make it 10,000, I'm guessing. As we go a bit along, they've got another Martian, um, it's called logo design there. And then we've got this one here, which is, it really reminds me of the uh, Williams livery of last season, where, I think it was last season, or 2018, when they had that really weird livery, uh, which looks like the uh, toothpaste, uh, Colgate, or whatever it was called. Uh, where if you just change the black on this to uh, a white, it would uh, really look like the old Williams livery. And we've got a bit further on, we've got a cool design there, it looks a bit like Ayrton Senna's uh, sort of colour scheme. And then we've got a cool alphabet race suit, another celebration here, Gains it's called. Uh, nothing special there, and then another one, Thinker. And we'll go a bit further on, and then that's another set of legendary coins which will take you up to 10k, which will be the... Uh, what you get on this tier and then this is the last tier here it's i say it's nothing special i think the livery it looks all right and then you get a uh, basic kind of a uh, race suit here so the uh tier podium pass series 2 i must say it's, it's decent it's got some cool ones i must say my favorite ones are the end races and ones they're very cool uh ones to have in the game as well as that alphabet one that's a very cool one and then my favourite livery is definitely this one, the Lamborghini sort of look to it, which I'm definitely going to be repping for the Italian Grand Prix in our next career mode um, when we next do the Italian Grand Prix. I don't know when it will be, probably in the next coming weeks. But anyway, we'll go along to the item shop now to have a look at what they've got in store. Here we've got a celebration here on the weekly item list, which is Pure Joy. That's a bit like Sebastian Vettel's ones, uh, one as well with his uh, kind of uh, Irish uh, shoe kick when he jumps up in midair. And then as we go a bit further on, there's a cool the redesign here. It's kind of like carbon fibre sort of look to it. And then it's just kind of basic helmet, gloves and um, race suit sort of look to it. But that will be it for today's video. I do hope you enjoyed the uh, first look at Series 2 Podium Pass. And next video probably will be the Jaguar. Um, first look at the uh, Jaguar idea for my team and then we're going to do a my team career mode at the end of the week but I do thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one